What's up, nerds? Phoenix from Phoenix TV here with an Achieve Guide. This time I'm going to show you how to get the Peyton Manning Legacy Award. Technically, this gets all the one before it because the Peyton, Man Peyton Manning one's the top one. So if you need any of those, and then the end one, this will get you through all of them. Anyway, first thing you want to do is from the home screen, go to the uh, Customize section on the far right and Share and Manage Files and Download Community Files. Then from there, search out the Dallas 99 roster. There's a bunch of them, so just pick whichever one has the most downloads recently, just to make sure that no one's trying to mess with you. But anyway, do uh, do that, download it, and then once you're done with that, uh, go to the Load and Delete Files section and load up your roster, your new Dallas 99 roster. From there, go back home, then select Franchise, and then do a new franchise that's got the, the cloud setting thing on it. I don't entirely know what it means, but use that. From there, Start a new franchise, use your act using the new roster. And then unfortunately for non-Cowboy fans, you have to pick the Cowboys. Sorry. Uh, from there, under the league, and then once you get past all that, go to the league settings and change your skill level to all Madden, re-sign players to on, progress players to on, and sign free agents to on. It's, it does all the automatic coaching stuff that you don't have to worry about. This just helps you whenever you simulate through this. Now, save those settings and go back and select your role, make a coach, new coach, team builder, as the settings on it. Accept and continue. Select advance week and jump ahead 10 years. It won't take 10 years, and this is like a four minute simulation thing. But over the course of the simulation, it'll progressively go through the season, and based on these stats, it'll, means you don't have to do anything, but it'll keep building up your legacy score somehow or another. And around year three or four, maybe even five, uh, it'll finally unlock. You'll have got an incredibly high legacy score without playing a single game. For a lot of points. Let me total them up right quick. It's worth 250 gamer score if you didn't have any of these before this. So, there you go. A nice and easy way to get 250 gamer score in a football game without loading up a single actual game. This has been Phoenix from Phoenix TV. I hope this helped you as much as it helped me. Thanks for watching.